What's going on everyone? My name is Shady and welcome back to Resin Resident Evil. No. Rise of Insanity. <laughs> Sorry. Um I really should get back into that game. I didn't quite finish that one. But anyways, um we're back and we're back in the morgue. And this is gonna be terrifying. So yeah, get ready for some fun. Um not exactly sure what's going to happen. I just need to explore for now, I guess. Kind of afraid. Because of the fact that last time I was here, something scared the bejesus out of me. Oh wait, there was a note on this table. I almost forgot. Okay, one of three. It looks like a light and a chair. Daddy, I'm lost. It was so sad. I lost my figurines. Please find them for me. What figurines are you referring to? I have no idea what you're talking about. Okay. Am I facing forward? Because I feel like I'm not. But anyways... Um, wow. This is going to be a little bit creepy, I think. Because now I have a dead son that I know of, apparently. And, yeah. Oh, this is going to be good. Um, so yeah, um, I wanted to somewhat apologize for my last video. I got really emotional, uh, into my into what I wanted this channel to be and it took away from the fact that I'm supposed to be playing a game promise it won't happen again not unless I'm doing a uh, actual video it's of that particular sort so anyways let's go into these rooms the ones that I neglected to go into last time because they were creepy as hell what is that? I can't tell what that is. Um, promise. There's some kind of light in there. I don't know what that is. Um, but yeah. Anyways, so we're trying to find. Looks like figurines that we're supposed to find. Um. Uh, no, no, no. I'm um, okay. I bet you that's where the, the figurine is, too. Not somewhere where I want to be. Oh, goddamn. <sighs> Going in. This looks like the place where I'm supposed to be at. Yep, there it is. That's the chair. And that's the light. Dresser, or no, that's a file cabinet, third drawer. Ooh, you are creepy. Oh. Oh. Why? Why Why is this a thing that you have to be a, a child's toy? Why do you have to be a child's toy? That's so creepy. I'm taking a screenshot of you because that, that was, ooh. Yeah, that was, that's, that's, ooh. Uh, uh, uh. Oh god, what the hell happened? Oh, I think I adjusted my height. What the hell was that? Oh god, I gotta stop cussing because I'm cussing too much. Oh, good! The elevator's here. That must mean I'm done down here in the morgue. Oh, okay. I thought there was something else here. I thought the door was... Let's see if I missed anything in here. It 
that's a bloody bed. And I'm being bloody. I'm not trying to speak British here. Oh god. That is a close up shot of that picture. Oh god. I had to back that up. Can I go in here? There's absolutely nothing here. I bet you there was a scare in here and I'd missed it. Last time I went down this hallway, something jumped out of that doorway almost. I was trying to anyway. Alright, well then. Let's just push that button. And tell that place they can go somewhere else, you know what I mean? Go somewhere where somewhere hot. A lot of flames out of that. Oh good, I'm back here. Why did the orchestra just uh erupt? Is that what is that the correct terminology? I have no idea. But why? feeling that something was coming up. Very bad feeling. No, oh, good. The elevator's not there. Okay. Um, sorry, I had to adjust my uh, headset a little bit. Oh, good, good, good. Everything's um, rearranged. Oh, good. The, 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 the numbers are no longer there. It was all in my head. What's that? Woman received 30 swa uh, stab wounds. I thought it said swab wounds. I was like, what the heck? Uh, while the child was two days later strangled in his sleep. Ooh, gruesome. Oh, wait! This poster was over there, wasn't it? Or was it over here? I don't know. I, I, that could have been there, and then that was just right here. I don't know. I bet you that in my office. Man, if I didn't know this was here, I would have been creeped out as soon as I came in here. I would have been, I probably would have jumped. Patient Eddie, 41. Day. <laughs> Having oh acquainted God. with the traumatic Is Eddie's that? past life, violence in the family and pathology, I've decided that I will use a less invasive method of treatment we can handle without hypnosis. The confrontation with the past and dreams connected with some mild anxiolytics should be enough. I think that finishing the dream, so killing the wife and child can join his split cells. All we need to do is wait and observe. I was, I, I literally was not expecting something to move. I was just expecting a scare at the doorway as soon as I put that cassette tape down. I was not expecting something to move. Yeah, no. Weren't these drawers before? I could swear these were, these were drawers. Dear Steven, analysis, an anal bleh, analysis, and analyzing your previous letters and observations, I think that the problem is connected, smeared. Uh, 
please think about it one more time. I'm worried about you and your family. When I come back from Smeared... <laughs> Smeared is a very common place, apparently. It's a very common noun, verb, and adjective. I'll tell you what. Um, I will visit... I will visit you and we will talk. Abraham, P.S. Send your wife and child somewhere. Assure that they are safe. I feel like there's something violent in this place. No duck? No duck? Okay. I'm not going down there. Not without something. Oh, I can't go down this way. Okay, then. But I can't see down there at all. It's just pitch darkness. How am I supposed to know what's in there? Look how dark it is in here. Oh god, I don't like darkness at all. I suddenly started walking. Why am I walking so slowly now? Did I just see something? What was that? I saw something. I, I saw something. I don't know what I saw, but I saw something. There was something over there next to the wall there in between the two doorways. I swear to God, I saw something there. I don't know what it was, but I saw it. I'm going to go back when I, when I uh, edit this thing. I'm going to find out what the heck that was. Am I still facing forward? Yeah, I am. Okay. Oh my god, I have to constantly check myself to make sure I'm facing forward because I tend to move in these things sometimes. I know in the last couple of videos, the last few times that I've actually recorded this game, I haven't moved really at all. Just my head, really. Which is the point, really, for me. I mean, I'm trying not to move. Um, but this is going to be weird. Yeah, I swear to god, there was something right here. I don't know what that was. And did the elevator just move right past this place? Because it started upstairs, and then it moved, and then went down to the morgue. It just passed this, 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 these elevator doors. It's weird. Yeah, it must be one of the drawers. There's four drawers there. How am I supposed to know which one's which? Because I know it's 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 the third one down. I just don't know which one. Oh, there's another picture in there. Red pen. Oh, why would you open that way? Oh, good, good. Nope, nope, nope. Not going to any bathrooms today. Thank you very much. I will say screw you and be gone with you. Yeah. No bathrooms today. Unless I have a good reason to go in there. Oh, what if there's a duck in there? I haven't found one yet. This is breaking this... news. As the investigation has shown, the police have established that the brutal murder of the family of the famous doctor of psychology was caused by the local gardener, Edward S. Hmm. <coughs> Excuse me. You know, you guys played that game uh, on the PS4 when it first came out. Um, uh, what's that game called? It's a horror game. Uh, um, dang it. There's another one about psychology and whatnot and the choices that you make. I forget what it was called. Dang it. I gotta, I gotta check that out again. I totally forgot. But anyways, there's a, there's a doctor in that thing that I think really fits this, this guy's description. All right, here we go. What is it? I don't know what it is. I can't tell what it is either. If you guys can tell me what this is exactly, what you guys see in this picture, let me know in the comments because I have no clue whatsoever. I'm very bad at these things, I'll tell you what. I, I really couldn't tell you. Supposedly these things really tell you like your psychological state of mind. All right, so it's in one of these drawers. Aha! Uh -huh. 
Why do you have to be so creepy? Oh, you are creepy. Uh, I hate your guts. I'm taking another screenshot. Just for safekeeping. Oh, there's something underneath here. Three. In oh my god, here we go. This is where I'm gonna find the third one in the bathroom. <sighs> Why did it have to be the third one? Why did it have to be the third one in the bathroom? Why couldn't the second one be in the bathroom? It would have been nice to have the first one or the second one as in the bathroom. Not the third one, the second or first one. I will gladly take it. I hate bathrooms as far as scary games because something always happens. Every time. Every time. Something always happens. No, I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining whatsoever. I'm actually thoroughly enjoying myself. Um, but sometimes these games can be a douche. I'll tell you what. Because now I'm going into a haunted bathroom and something's gonna jump out at me. <gasps> Don't do that! Did I do that? No, I didn't do that. What the heck? I thought I did that. That would have been really cool if I actually did that. Because I. Mm. Oh dear. I don't like it because I have to actually go through the stalls. I am obligated to go into the stalls. No duck. No duck. No duck. No duck. Okay. Yep, I am obligated. Oh, nothing in that stall. Hi. Can I help you? A ducky. Alright, time to close see some some things. Oh. Why? Why does it have to be the one behind the wall? <laughs> Why did it have to be that one? Sure, fine, I'll take that one to fall down, but not the middle one right next to that freaking creepy doll. Or action figure, excuse me. In case that boy is actually listening. Oh, man. I'm kind of afraid right now because I have... There's two things here. There's one, the shower curtain, which could have something in it. Or two, the bathroom stall that was locked. Mm, not looking good at all for me. I'm not looking good. I'm not looking. Uh, not looking forward to this. Oh God! What are you? What are you? I have no idea what you are. That is creepy. Nothing? I actually thought something was going to happen. Okay. Is that the elevator? That was the elevator. I think. Oh, great. I didn't close that door. Something else did. Just perfect. Ah! Oh my god, that scared the crap out of me. Oh my god, my heart. <laughs> oh, that was good. The best one yet so far this 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 whole playthrough. Oh, my heart is pounding. Whew. That was good. I really really enjoyed that scare. Oh man, I was not expecting it at all. Oh, oh man. <laughs> Holy crap. That scared the heck out of me. It was just a bird. Not even 
not even playing on that. It was just a bird that's just flying out of, out of the inside the doorway. Is this door now open? Nope. Where's that bird? I won't shoot it. I won't kill it. Ghost bird apparently. Oh my god, that was the best scare yet. All the other ones were cheap and and sort of anticipated. But this one takes the cake out of all the scares that I've been experienced in this game. I was I was actually anticipating a scare in the bathroom. The curtain was a nice touch. I was expecting something to to scare me and pop out of the um, the stall or the curtain, not through the door I actually needed to go out of. The only place I can go to. And this chair is just here randomly. No. <laughs> oh, man. I don't know why I keep putting my hands up to defend myself or anything like that, but that's just... Mm, I gotta stop doing that, because that... I, mm, I'm gonna break something one of these days. Um, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm definitely gonna break something one of these days. Wait a minute. What, did, what deuce... No, not the blood. Not the blood. Oh god, I'm gonna drown in blood. Ah! Ooh. Dear god. Wait, what? Where am I going? I'm just pushing it. Oh god, what the heck is this? Oh, I'm. Oh, dude. Oh my god. What is going on? I'm so confused. I'm just. Oh my god. <laughs> what? Oh god. Oh, I am so creepy. Creeped out right now. You don't even know this is creepy as frick. Oh, everything just turned bloody. Everything turned bloody. Please don't jump scare me. I went to the light. Oh, I'm flying again. I'm a bird. Yay. I thought I would be able, to be able to be a bird again. But I don't know where I'm going. There's no light. Oh, there we go. Oh, this room again. The phone. Okay. I was expecting a jump scare during that whole wheelchair incident. Thank you, honey. But why? Because I felt like it. What else? Dang, women are never satisfied. <laughs> okay, it's loading. Where am I now? I'm in darkness. It looks like the garden again. What? What is? Oh, this is a flashlight. Oh, this is so cool. I have now a light. That's the greenhouse. Which has one door. No. Not going in there, apparently. Was this building here before? Ooh, I see things going so wrong in here. So there's a lot of pitchforks in here.
Why did I need tape? Sometimes I terribly suffer because I have to restrain myself. When I see you with such a beautiful knife in your hand, when you prepare dinner, I imagine then you and me in an embrace with cold steel in your bowels. I look at your beautiful eyes, then gaze with tears, in which life slowly goes out. I would dream to make the last kiss on your fading lips. Creepy. Did I say that creepy like, I think I did. Oh! Oh, I should have known that. Oh, I should have known that. It's a shovel man. No, it's Slender Man with the with a shovel. Okay. So what's this? There's something here. I haven't found a rubber ducky yet. And the bridge is out of her, huh? There's a lot of birds. Is that something shiny in the in the distance? Oh no, it's just light. Alrighty then. What's this? The oh, the, the, the car here has headlights, which I have to get on the other side to... I have to get on the other side to turn on the lights. Oh god, that was actually creepy like... Alright, I'm closing that. Vanquish the darkness. I don't know what's going to happen, but... Oh, dear. This looks bad. Oh, is that a hole? I need to see if there's a rubber duck in here first. I feel like this would be a good spot for one. What was that? What was that? I don't like the sound of that. I'm not getting that yet, because I have a feeling that I need to look for something first. And there's a phone. I already know where that's going. It's gonna transition me again. After another gi giant jump scare, I already know it. Dead boy buried in the garden. As a result of the ongoing investigation, the police found the body of Theodore Dowell, son of a well-known psychologist, was murdered and then buried in the greenhouse on the property <clears throat> by the gardener Edward S. That's rude. So you ha you get a gardener that apparently uh, I'm not done with you yet. Um, that apparently you trust 
to walk around your grounds, tend your garden, and then you don't, and then he kills your son? That's, that's cryptic as hell. Come for me, please. Mom is lying here. She is so cold. All right, loading again. That was kind of short, not gonna lie. Between the transition from the back from the hospital to this place to the gar back to the garden area, and then to the end of that it was actually kind of short. Not gonna lie. But how much time do I have left? Oh, yeah, I'll have to wait till next episode. I swear to God, if I'm almost done with this game <clears throat> when I do the next episode, I swear I'm gonna be mad because I'm not sure how far how much more of this game I have. It seems like I'm almost done. I'm not entirely sure though. I'm, I'm never good at these whole recognizing the fact that I'm almost done with the game. This definitely seems end game-ish. And there's a lot of uh, mist that can move around when I turn my head. Anyways, so I'm going to call it here. Um, yeah, this seems like a good place to stop. Because this, seem, this seems very endgame-ish. So, yeah, I'm going to end it right here. Um, and this is going to be a wild ride, I'll tell you what. It, it start, it's already a, a wild ride. Um, but yeah, let me just quit that real quick before something happens. And I'm going to regret not having my headphones on, or my headset on when I do that. Um, but yeah, it's, this is turning out to be very good. I can't wait for the next episode. I'll take that off. And so yeah, look forward to the next one, because that's not too far away. I'm going to take that thing off, because my, my, I was sweating over here, I'll tell you what. Um, but yeah, look forward to the next episode, guys. Um, it's really turning out to be a really good game. <clears throat> a lot of good jump scares in it. If you guys want to try it for yourself, uh, I highly recommend doing it with a VR headset because it definitely immerses you a lot. Like, if I wasn't playing, if I wasn't doing these playthroughs for you guys, I think I'd be a lot more scared than I was. That one in the bathroom was the best one so far. Like, I wouldn't want to be alone in a room, in this room, in the dark playing this game because it was it's that bad or that good of scares i should really rephrase that but anyways so <clears throat> so highly try it for yourself let me know what you guys think of uh of the, the game um so far because we're almost done so hopefully so that way i have because i have another video for you guys soon so thank you guys so much for watching if you guys enjoyed this uh video episode series whatever you want to call it <laughs> um uh let me know in the comments below and don't forget to leave a like um if you're new to my channel and you just found this video don't forget to s hit the that subscribe button and also one more thing if you guys want to know more or keep an update but anyways um don't forget to leave your likes and comments down below and um hit that bell button if you guys want to keep updated with my channel and whatnot um, below the video here so thank you guys and i'll see you guys later